Hi fellow traders and investors, this is Joe Grinder from InvestorsHelp.net here in Silicon Valley, California. Hopefully you're all having a great day. It's a beautiful day here in the 70s for the 24th of February. You can't beat that. Well, we're not here to talk about the weather. We're talking about making money in the financial markets. Speaking about that, this past week I attended a new meetup group that is a new meetup group for me since I had never attended it before called Silicon Valley Low Frequency Algorithmic Trading Meetup. How's that for a mouthful? <laughs> anyway, you know, there's no such thing as a holy grail in, the, in trading and in investing. However, after attending Alan Liu's presentation this past week, he sure gets pretty close to it. Alan takes, let's say, $4,400 and on a weekly basis either doubles it or some days when it's very volatile he makes, let's say, $4,000 or so a day on that investment. So that is very interesting not only to me but also to the numerous people who attended this meetup group. So Alan was gracious enough to allow me to videotape his recordings and that's what we're going to share with you today. The recording session was close to four hours or so long. So what I did, the first 74 minutes I have on video, there are four videos regarding session one refresh. In other words, many of the attendees had not been at Alan's first presentation a few weeks ago. So he reviewed the uh, session one so that you understand the basics and where he's coming from. Then we took a short break and Alan went into almost a two-hour session where we have um, six videos on session two. And in the future there should be, uh, from what I understand, a session three and four. So the current offerings at InvestorsHelp.net is session one refresh and then in the next few days I'll be going ahead and adding the six videos for session two. So let's see what's contained in these videos. Before I show you what is contained in the videos, uh, they, it's important to know where do you find them. It's easy. All you need to go is type into your browser investorshelp.net and you'll see my landing page like this. Um, I added right at the top the new videos from this recent meetup. In fact when you open up you'll see two. There'll be this one, a red one here, red and white, and there'll be another one here. This will be session one refresh. Those are the four videos. You'll soon see another box here, which will be session two, and there will be six videos there. So all you need to do at the landing page would be to click either here or to click there, and you'll be taken to uh, vimeo.com where you can access these videos. While you're on my landing page, feel free to click on my picture for a free sign up to the other information. We have a lot of oh, over a hundred videos, most of which are free, that is available uh, for traders and investors. Also, if you live in Northern California, click here, coming events, and I have a listing of meetings and presentations that are scheduled for the next several weeks. So that's how you get to uh, Alan's work. Alan's presentation begins here, as you can see, the basics of algorithmic strategy trading. And you can contact Alan. He's a very friendly gentleman um, here at the Apache Room at gmail.com. The Apache Room is located here in San Jose. In fact, it's very close to where Alan and I live. So it makes it convenient uh, to, uh, to meet in the future at the Apache Room. 
Okay, here is some of the information that Alan covers in Session 1 Refresh. This is a review, a repeat of what happened at Session 1 where I and many others had not attended. He talks about the day trading algorithm, talks about futures, uh, contracts, day trading is war and how to win the war, asks who's the worst enemy before 2007, who's the worst enemy after 2007, and of course, what or who is your best friend in the financial markets. Here's some additional information that is covered by Alan. Who invented the wheel in the futures market? In other words, who does Alan look to for a good foundation of knowledge and experience? When is the market fair and level and what tools do you use to determine that? Is the market rigged and manipulated? I think some of us would definitely say yes, but the question is what do you do? How, how do you become successful in a market that's rigged and manipulated? Well, it's all covered by Alan in his presentation. And then he even gets into what he calls the preferred strategy and you'll have details available to you in these videos. Also during the session one refresh Alan reviews five rules that's imperative that you need to follow um, in order to be successful using the strategy or strategies that he has developed. Those are all reviewed in detail for you. This part of the presentation on the session one refresh I found very interesting because he talks about indicators and strategies and the fact that there is open code available uh, for your use. He gets into charting tools, what analysis tools, uh, how do you do back test, the importance of back testing your strategy and also uh, walk, walk forward which is out of sample testing. You'll learn about that if you don't currently know the difference between back tests and walk forward testing. There's some advantages, uh, definite advantages in trading in the Roth IRA. He's also reviewing that and uh, apparently several people in other countries, especially in Taiwan and also China, are using these strategies to make significant money uh, in the financial markets. One of the capabilities of TradeStation, which I did not know about, is Trade Graph. So that was interesting. Even though I've used TradeStation for many years, I've never used Trade Graph. So if you're a TradeStation user and you don't know what Trade Graph is, uh, I think you'll find this most interesting. Also, how to detect whipsaw price journey and predators footprints. It's all here. Also, during the session one refresh, Alan gets into a lot of the details on the financial rewards that he's been experiencing uh, using his system. Gets into, you know, percent probability, average uh, win versus average loss, goes into the largest losing trades in, in, in his uh, description, max drawdowns, expects monthly returns, and uh, how he goes about picking the right animal for actually trading. But uh, what caught our eye, of course, is the percent probability of win is 80 to 100 percent. That is truly significant. I bet you wish you also had a strategy that could return 80 to 100 percent. As I mentioned, the first four videos uh, covered the session one refresh. Now the next six, uh, six <laughs> videos uh, at the beginning of session two that we have available for you really covers only part 9, 10, 11, and 12. 
just due to time constraints, uh, Alan has so much information to share. So he promised that in the next session, he's going to get into greater detail on these additional parts. So there's just a wealth of information that Alan has shared with us. And thank God that uh, I was there videotaping it because now it's available for for you to see and to hear and to learn from Alan. Because Alan could not cover all of the information during the first two sessions, uh, he will schedule a session three. And this is the agenda for sessions three. He's going to get, once again, more detail on the algorithmic back test, uh, in sample test, how to do optimization, doing the walk forward test and then doing out of sample uh, tests. Going to get into real time live data simulation and uh, real time uh, data live trade based for slippage automation software. Look at the trade manager and he's going to give us more examples of algorithmic trading. And these are his different systems, I think he called it, that uh, he is currently using. He's always trading, the way I understand it, multiple systems, and then that way they're all fine-tuned slightly different. So that helps uh, for the protection on the downside, because when you have one that may be out of favor, there's another one, of course, that's in favor. So he may be trading as many as four or six systems, I don't know for sure, that uh, he'll be sharing with us in future meetings, especially during this session number three. So you'll want to check back, assuming I do this again, it takes a lot of time. In fact, some guys were asking, well, Joe, why are you charging for this? You know, just from the, the first uh, meeting that I attended, I put in already 10 or 12 hours, you know, reviewing, uh, cutting the raw feed, editing it, uh, and then loading it. So it's just a lot of work. So at, you know, 595 for access to each of the sessions, um, to me, I think it's a very reasonable price. I should be selling these for, you know, $99 uh, per session, but I promised the guys that were in attendance that I would just make it very reasonable. You know, like the, the going to Starbucks, you spend five, six bucks easily uh, when you have uh, a good cup of coffee and uh, a nice uh, roll or something. So anyway, I'm going to put these up. There is a small administrative charge. If you can't afford it, well, you probably really shouldn't be in trading. You know, it sort of just blows my mind. And I don't want to get on my soapbox here when a person can't spend $5.95 for access to all of this good information that's not available to you sitting at home in your living room. In fact, if you came to the meeting and spent $15 on dinner, um, you know, you had a cost there. Whereas if you're sitting at home, you didn't attend the meeting. So for $5.95, uh, guys, uh, to me, it's a, it's a good deal. But anyway, I, I encourage you to review all of these videos numerous times. Um, I believe that Alan is available if you have some questions or you could send them to me at um, investorshelp.net and I'll be happy to consolidate those for you. So enjoy the videos, learn a lot, and profit from what you learn. You take care. Joe Grinder signing off from uh, investorshelp.net. So long.